I made one of the most overpowered tools for my private indicator. The breakout probability tool. Yeah, it's f***ing awesome. And the results? Well, let's say they're pretty good. So good that you can use it to predict the chance of a breakout occurring. This is an absolute game changer. And to prove that point, I'm gonna show you how it works, what it is, and how to use it to the best of its ability. You can use this tool for finding the chance of a breakout occurring, use it for placing perfect stop losses based on actual math, or even use it on higher time frames to see the probability of the chart moving up or down that day. If you can't tell, I'm extremely excited about this tool. At the end of the video, I'll give some of my greatest tips for using it so you can enter great breakout trades just like this. All right, let's do this. To start us off, let's go deep into the indicator's algorithm and show you how this tool actually works. This tool helps you understand the likelihood of the next candle's direction, which can be really useful when creating your trading bias. Now, you may be asking, how the hell does it do that? The breakout probability tool calculates the probability of a new high or low of the next candle and then displays it as a percentage value. Pretty cool, huh? This tool is actually always actively backtesting behind the scenes. So you're actually trading off real live probabilities in real time when using this tool. What the algorithm actually does is calculates all the green and red candles separately depending on whether the previous candle was green or red. Then it'll know if one of the line values was reached. The first lines will always be at the low and high of the candle. The algorithm then calculates how many candles reach those levels in past history and displays it as a percentage value on each line. So for example, we see this candle is green, so it'll look at all the past previous green candles, then it'll calculate what the percentage chance and which level the next candle is likely to hit. So in the example, we see that a new high has been hit 60.95% of the time, and the low was hit 30.50% of the time. Then we also have all these other levels that were hit in the past, but since they're so low or high from the original point, they have a lower chance of being hit again. So we see that from this point, the next candle has a higher chance of going up than down based off of actual past price history. Since the high value has a greater chance of getting hit than the lower value, we can predict the next candle will probably go up. And look what happens, it goes up. I'm telling you game changer. Now, there are a lot of different ways you can use this tool. One of the ways is to predict the probability of a breakout. Let me show you an example. So here we have our chart, and as you can see, we have a nice little resistance right here. The price then comes all the way up to it. Now, instead of just guessing whether the price is going to bounce off or break through this resistance, we're going to use the breakout probability tool to see which has a higher chance of happening, it breaking out or it rejecting. So we go to the settings of the indicator and enable the tool on our chart. Now that the tool is on our chart, you can see the next candle has a higher probability of going up than down, which means the next candle has a higher probability of breaking this resistance than rejecting. So in return, we can predict early that a breakout is about to happen. So we enter a trade before this even occurs. Look what happens, a breakout occurs and we make amazing profit. Cha -ching. Cha -ching. Now that's not the only way to use this tool. Oh no, you can also do it the other way around. Say if you enter down here and price is going up, you're in the profit, but price is getting really close to this resistance and you don't know if you should exit the trade early or not and wait for it to try to break out. Well, if we take out the probability tool, there's a higher chance of the next candle making a low than a high, which means price is likely to reject off this resistance. So it might be a good idea to exit your trade up here. So that's exactly what we end up doing. And look what happens, price rejects and falls. So we got out at the perfect point for this trade. Isn't this tool awesome? Just wait, we haven't even got to the good part. Another way you can use it is for setting up stop losses. What I mean by this is you can look at the lower values and set your stop loss based on where the price is most likely not to reach. So what you would do is go on a higher time frame like the one hour or daily. Turn on your probability tool and check the lower red values. See what the odds are for the next candle. If there's a very low probability, set your stop loss there, so there's less of a chance of it being hit. The third and final way I 
like to use this indicator is predicting the direction of the market for that day. This is definitely my favorite way to use this tool. What you would do is go on a higher time frame. I would recommend checking the daily or weekly. Turn on the probability tool and look at the percentages. Here you can see on the daily chart, the next candle has a higher probability of moving upwards, which means today is likely to be a green day and you can expect the chart to head upwards that day. So what you would do is then go to a lower time frame and do all your normal technical analysis, but now you know in the back of your head that this day is more likely to be a green day. And you could end up using that with your trading bias when performing trades on a lower time frame. So for example, only taking long trades that day. And obviously if it was more likely to be a red day, you would only take short trades that day. Like I said, this is an absolute game changer and you really have to use it for yourself to see how powerful it is. If you want to try it out, it's one of my many tools on my private indicator. I'll leave a link in my description or you can just go to my website tradinglab.ai. This is just one of the many tools included with the indicator. If you want to learn more about my indicator and all the other amazing tools included with it, check out this video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.